Hey there, guys. Uh, so there's an open tag going around. Uh, best three knives. Uh, large, over 8 inch. Fixed blade. A fixed blade, under 8 inch. And a folder. Um, I don't know much about these open tags. I don't know if I need to be tagged by somebody or if I'm supposed to tag somebody. Um, and can I tag somebody if I haven't been tagged? I don't know what the rules. But um, I don't have that many fixed blades. But I figured I would show my favorite uh, large fixed blade over 8 inches. Be the SOG Seal Pup Elite. I believe it's Oz 8 steel. This one does have the serrations. Very sharp. I bumped my thumb with a serration once and it just filleted it. Um, cool fixed blade knife. Feels great in the hand. Good place for your thumb. Tons of jimping on top. It's razor sharp. Uh, it's a overall length of 9 and 3 eighths inch. Uh, the blade length is 4 and 7 eighths inch long. Like I said, there's plenty of uh, other larger fixed blades I probably like better than this, but I don't have them, so I really don't know. So for my uh, under 8 inch fixed blade, we have the awesome giant butcher. <laughs> This thing is about uh, five and three quarter inches long, two and a half inch blade. It is uh, 154 cm steel, razor sharp. I can only get three fingers on this, so I got the lanyard here. Um, it's kind of cool. Um, you can't do much except butcher a mouse with it um, or butcher garlic. If I had my other hand out, you can put your thumb there and just sit there and chop up garlic really good. Uh, it's a pretty cool knife. The designer on this one is uh, Eddie Macho Diaz. It's got brown micarta handles. Really nice thick blade stock. Uh, and you got to watch your finger right here. Don't want to nick it. Nice Kaiser. Uh, they were more pricey than I really wanted to spend for it, but I had some points at uh, Mojave Outdoors. I think I got it for like twelve fifty, and so I paid five dollars shipping. So overall, it was like seventeen fifty. And for a Kaiser fixed blade with one fifty four cm steel, that's a deal. Uh, that would be my uh, small fixed blade. A good EDC comes with this. Uh, Kydex sheath. You can put it, uh, hang it scout style on your belt. Works good. I'd pull it in and out, but I'm outside because it is so nice that I'm uh, one-handing this video. Uh, and the folder, <clears throat> this one's a tough one for me. I really want to pick a slip joint. So many slip joints I don't like. But um, I just had to go with this. Kaiser Beg Letter 2, Tonto. I got this a while ago, and the action on it is just so sweet. Just drops shut. I can just sit here and play with it forever. The bearings are incredible. It's got um, black micarta scales. Um, it is an Azo design. Let's see if I can focus on that. A-Z-O. It is also... 154 cm steel it's a hollow grind blade and then the tip is a flat grind that's probably getting blurry you probably can't see that um just a remarkable knife fits so good in the hand really nice blade stock you can see how the jumping goes all the way down and the blade's thick all the way down Close to the tip. So yeah, let's get out of the shadows here. That's all in the shadows.
That would be um, that would be my pick. Um, if I can tag somebody, which I don't know the rules, if I can, I tag uh, Randy WSG. Let's see what he has. Maybe a few swords. Awesome. Thank you, guys.